Well, the FBI tells us Officer Houston Largo died around 3 o'clock this afternoon here at the University of New Mexico Hospital. He was airlifted here earlier this morning with critical injuries. Police say it all started on a rural road on the Navajo Reservation when Officer Houston responded to a domestic violence call just before midnight on Saturday. The FBI says someone is in custody related to the shooting, but the agency is not telling us that person's name. The Navajo Nation now shaken by the news of Officer Largo's death. The president of the Navajo Nation, Russell Begay, traveled to UNMH today to be with Officer Largo's family. He says in a statement, one of the most trying times I have in serving as president of the Navajo Nation is when I get word that one of our police officers has had their life taken needlessly. The Navajo Nation's vice president, Jonathan Nez, says Officer Largo is a great example of an officer who paid the ultimate sacrifice to protect the life of another. There are still a lot of unanswered questions about what happened before Officer Largo was shot. And the FBI is working with New Mexico State Police and the McKinley County Sheriff's Office to get more answers. We're live near UNM tonight. Justin Matthews, KOAT, Action 7 News.